Hi, I'm Edwin Tiong. I'm the voice actor for Yosaurus, one of Edge of Eternity's main characters, and I will be your host for this commentated gameplay. First things first, let's start this walkthrough by changing the party leader. I feel we should have someone with, uh, more class, more presence, more charisma. Hmm, someone like... There, exactly who I had in mind. Now we can get this thing started. So, this walkthrough takes place at roughly the middle of the game, in the Elysian Fields, where the party hopes to recruit their next member. Nothing like a small cutscene to set the mood. Seems like a good time to remind everyone that in addition to the already stellar English voice acting, the game will also feature Japanese voice acting on console release, and will be available as a free update for PC as well. At any time, you will be able to choose between the Japanese and the English version. Not that I'm biased towards one or the other, of course, totally impartial. ここバロン。自称空賊だ。どういうことかは俺にもわからないが、俺たちサイファーはアークリットの技術を盗んでほしいとき、いつもあいつに頼んでた。当然大金を払ってな。じゃあ、俺たちも払わないといけないのか。ああ
Ah, talking to NPCs. A staple in RPGs. What? No side quests? No loot? Just flavor text? Come on, don't make us believe there's an actual lore in this game. Okay, we get it. Ooh, shinies. A crystal, huh? This thing would fit right onto Selene's staff. Let's open up the menu and see our customization options. Ooh, theory crafting in sight. Let's put our newly found crystal in a slot right there. Now the Fire Rift 2 spell will be available in combat. Neato. Ah, there's a stalker. Scary. Sade, this is main dish. On top of the Fire Rift Crystal we have slotted earlier, we have also assigned Lightning Attack Crystals into our weapons, which will allow us to strike this enemy's elemental weakness. For difficult combat such as these, character placement is important, as it can both allow your characters to evade some of the enemy's most dangerous attacks, as well as set up devastating sneak attacks. See those red figures? It means the attack has been extra painful, probably because we struck the enemy from behind. Hey, don't judge me. It's a tactical RPG. I have every right to do this. Let's assert dominance by taking a nap right in the middle of the fight. Power move right there. Now the only thing left to do is to leave the other teammates at it while our lovable rascal continues sleeping and replenishing his HP. Come on, guys, make yourselves useful. Do something, no, I don't know, a uh, special attack, maybe?
Positively radical. And this concludes the fight. Easy peasy. Our quest objective is getting close. This could very well be the transmitter we're looking for. See? I was right. ハロン、聞こえるか? ファロン、聞こえるか。聞こえてるはずだ。ファロン、返金してくれ。前回の分が機能しない。返金しないならもうお前に金は。あんたが返金してもらえるとでも。聞こえてるじゃないか。はあ、聞こえてるよ。警備
Back on the field. The dreaded vanguard shouldn't be too far. something extra for our most beloved character. Well deserved, I'd say. Oh, and by the way, if you're not too fond of digging the dirt to get new weapons, you can craft them. The game includes more than a hundred weapons, all with their own specific customizable crystal tree. ちょっと待ってくれ。もう大丈夫。ちょっと目まいがしただけだ。時間がない。行くぞ。So, this wraps up our little walkthrough. I hope you enjoyed it. On behalf of the whole Midgar Studios team and myself, thank you for your interest in Edge of Eternity. The game will be released on PlayStation 4 and 5 on the 10th of February. Thanks again for watching. See you soon in Harrion.